So first tap here is our IPA. Um, it's definitely our, our flagship beer. We sell um, far and away more of that than probably all the others combined. Um, it's uh, your standard Northwest IPA, nice and hoppy, but with a good malt backbone. It's not, you know, just punchy in the face hops. Uh, for the for the punchy in the face hops, we've got the Industrial IPA, which is our sort of moniker for uh, Imperial or Double IPA. Um, it's about 25% more alcohol and twice as the hops of the regular IPA. Um, people tend to be kind of fanatical about that one. Um, our brown ale is very popular too. It's just an American style brown, really mild and approachable, uh, not hoppy, um, not real bitter or anything. Um, our stout is a dry Irish style stout. We typically pour it on a, on a nitro presentation, similar to, uh, to Guinness. Uh, Blonde ale is our summer seasonal. Uh, really light beer. Um, it's based on um, one of our founders, uh, Brian Sullenberg. His dad used to brew for Pabst back in, in the East Coast, and um, this was, I guess, one of his recipes uh, based on a pre-prohibition era lager. It is an ale, but it, uh, it tries to be a lager. <laughs> um, ESB is just that, our extra special bitter. Uh, Possession Porter is our, uh, our robust porter. Um, it's really nice and chewy. Um, you know, got a big body to it. A lot of hops, but they're kind of covered up by the by the dark malts. Um, Scottish ale is one that we do uh, just once a year or so, specifically for the the Highland Games out on Whidbey. Um, it's a it's a fun you know light uh, light Scottish with a little bit of peated malt. Um, the Whip Ale is uh, is a beer that we do in conjunction with Michael Wilton from Queensrÿche. Um, his nickname is Whip, and that's his logo and stuff. And uh, so they go out and market the beer under the using the Queensrÿche uh, fan base and all that, and we make it for them as as needed. Uh, Hefeweizen is uh, is a German style, Bavarian style Hef. Think bananas and cloves and really really cloudy stuff. Uh, and the Golden is just kind of rounds out our light beer selection. It's uh, it's similar to the Blonde, but it's got a little more a little more malt uh, based and uh, a different hop profile. A little bit, little bit bolder beer than the blonde, but still very light, approachable.